Hey everybody, welcome to Easy Edge DB. So this is a course that I put together a few years ago and then updated it recently. And it's uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, what it does is it, uh, it walks you through the uh, somebody who's getting used to Easy Edge DB for the first time and is trying to put together a schema for a game. And the game is based on Bram Stoker's Dracula. And Bram Stoker's Dracula is, uh, is a fantastic book for or databases if you're imagining um, you know what how we how you would take the data from from an existing book or something and uh, and try to put it into some some sort of form that you can use for for your game because the book itself is explained in um, its epistolary format which is like letters from letters and diary entries from uh, each of the characters and uh, so it has uh, like dates and um, and events and so on and uh, you can see, for example, like in the first chapter here, it starts out with Jonathan Harker. This is the, the very uh, start of the book. So it's got a date here and Bistritz, which is uh, Romania today, which is uh, Bistritz. So it's got an old name because this is from the uh, 19th century. So how, how do you work with like old names versus uh, new names? And you've got times here. And so you can, uh, you can, you know, I uh, potentially use this data to to like put you know which characters are in which cities at what time and, and what's going on and so the idea is you start learning uh, edge db for the first time and you're, you're putting together a schema and, and trying to get better and better at the uh, at putting together a schema and the query language so that you can um, get this data for a game that you might be putting together and so the book doesn't uh, ever get into what kind of game it's going to be because that would be in a, another programming language it's just about how to figure out uh, to wor uh, working with uh, HDB and the, the query language, which is called HQL, and how to um, get good at that so that uh, eventually you can put together a really nice uh, you know, type safe schema. Everything in HDB is type safe, um, strongly typed. And uh, so that is um, that lets your data be really, uh, really predictable and make these uh, like assertions that it has to be this type and um, uh, your data has to work in in this format um, instead of just having like a, a bunch of loose pieces of data that later on might uh, not um, act in the way that you wanted them to so that is the way um, the way it works and there's 20 chapters and you can see it starts out really simple and that's uh, that's what we're going to start doing in the next video so uh, just keep this um, introduction really short and uh, see you in chapter one part one